and welcome to Grateful Rescue TV. I'm Pamela Terhune and we're joined by a very special guest today, or two very special guests, <laughs> George Malay and Spots. Yep. George, tell me about Spots. Well, Spots has been with me since he was 10 months old. <clears throat> I got him when I was living in Milwaukee after my previous dog, Charlie, passed away. I went a whole week without a dog. And I know a lot of people wait, but um, and I went to the Wisconsin Humane Society. They, they put you in a little kind of habitat and you get to meet the dogs. And uh, he just came out and pretty much announced that he was coming home with me. So <laughs> he's just, um, he is the, he's, he's the most high energy animal I've ever had. And he just put his paws up on my shoulders and so we've been together ever since. And he said, take me home. Yes, he did. And he runs a five minute mile, you say? Um, he can run sub five minute miles and he can run a lot of them. So when I work this dog out and I, I run him every morning, I put him in a harness, I hook him to my bicycle and, uh, and he literally tows me like a sled dog. Oh it's my just, goodness. It's not a workout for me. I, I get my exercise later, but for him, it's a, it's a good way to start the day, so. And you affectionately call him Spotopotamus. The Spotopotamus. He, his <laughs> name was Spot at the Wisconsin Humane Society. And when my four-year-old son at the time, he's 10 now, Colton met him, Colton said, he's not Spot, he's Spots. So then that took, uh, and, and that's the neat thing. You know, the, he's, you know, obviously he's a pit mix. Mm -hmm. um, and I feel like these dogs get a bad rap. Absolutely. Uh, but my understanding is they were actually bred to be family dogs. Yep. And this dog bonded immediately with my son. They call them nanny dogs yeah. back in the day. And mm -hmm. you know, and they, um, they so whenever they get what? together, my, my son lives with his mother in Wisconsin still, um, but whenever Spots and Colton are together, they are just in constant physical contact. They Beautiful. just, they wrap themselves around each other, crawl into bed together, whatever, they're just, they're together. <laughs> they really are beautiful, so. beautiful dogs. And what brought you to Indiana? Give us a little history on that. Well, the woman to whom I'm related by marriage uh, was already here. Uh, she was my high school crush, and she, she'd been here uh, for, for decades. Um, and we started dating a few years ago. We were doing a long distance thing. And, mm -hmm. um, and so my goal was to be here, to be with Kathy. Uh, and then I got a job at Wish TV, so I got, I got the job of my dreams and, and the woman and of the my woman dreams. And the woman of your dreams. So, yeah, I'm, 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 I'm very blessed. I am so happy to be with Kathy and I'm so happy that our dogs, the junkyard dog here and her show dog, <laughs> have become fast pals and formed a pack together. So it's really good. Oh, well, thank you. Thank you for sharing all this. And Spot, you're such a good boy. It's just such a good boy. He's doing a lot of TV I today. love Spot. Spot <laughs> looks like Faith. If you know my dog Faith, this could be her twin brother. And she's she's a pit mix too. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So, yeah, Boxer yeah. Bulldog, yep. And we are so thrilled to have you and we thank you so much. And thank you, Spots. Well the pleasure is mine. And Spots too. <laughs>